So first of all, I've got the impression, not only me, also the people in Jerusalem, that we are gone, uh, we are 20 years back again. You know, I went to the hospital in order to visit the casualties, also the families of, uh, and it was, I mean, first of all, I mean, I must say that those images, I mean, really were, were shocking. Uh, you should see, I mean, uh, this uh, wife uh, who came to Israel from Ethiopia, where her husband was struggling, and today is the day, is the holiday or a great day of the, of the Ethiopian community. You would see this American Jew who came from, in 1988, from Queens, and he was there lying in bed after this horrible terrorist attack. You would see this, this father who looks at his son with all, I mean, those wounds he had because the bomb was really, really vicious. Or this mother, I mean, who sent her, her son to school in the morning and he will never come back. And those were horrible images. But especially from the team in the hospital. For them, I mean, it was going back 20 years ago because this kind of terrorist attack, Jerusalem didn't know since 2006. Horrific. And this is a situation that, unfortunately, we in Israel cannot accept. Well, Boaz, your, uh, the Likud party put out this statement today in the sensitive security period. It is time to put personal desires aside, unite, and form a national government that will restore security to Israel. So that raises the question, is this going to impact on these coalition negotiations and speed them up to form that government, that kind of government? So first of all, I must say, I mean, that this is so uh, uh, sad for, for, for us. I mean, I mean, Parliament came together last week. It was our first day in Parliament with this horrible attack in Ariel. And the week after this terrorist attack in Jerusalem, total failure of this actual government. We have to replace and very, very fast. Why am I saying that? Because all those terrorist attacks prove to us the uh, 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 this urgent, urgent uh, situation in Israel right now that we have to change the government. We have to change policy. I think that we know how to deal with those uh, threats uh, we're dealing with, with all this, with this uh, terrorist attacks. Yet, in order to do that, we need to form our government. And I call, I, I, I call, I mean, our partners in the right wing uh, 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 parties that we have, I mean, to speed up in order to to, to, to form this government. I must tell you, and I'll be very honest with you, Caleb, today when I was in hospital, I saw, I mean, all those people who voted for right-wing voters, and they're very much disappointed because they expect us to form a government. We really could. We're willing. We wanted to do it already, I mean, from the first days. Unfortunately, it takes still, it takes t too much time. Hopefully, in the coming days, I hope we'll finally have a government that will give a good response to those terrorists that I can bring deterrence again to Israel. All right. I will note that all of the coalition uh, le uh, party leaders have said the same thing. They all want to get going on it, uh, and we'll see if it, uh, this uh, incident today actually... Well, I... Go ahead, boss. I... I, I must say, I, I must say one thing. I looked at our partners right now, and I think that on the contrary, in a very difficult like today, we can be very optimistic because the coming government, on the contrary, has all the tools and the, the, the how would I say, this common ideology that permits us to fight, I mean, to fight against all those terrorist groups, something that the uh, government uh, or the old coalition or the, 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 the coalition that will get out, I mean, that will leave, uh, 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 did not have. So I think that on the contrary, it's really urgent. Now, I look at our partners, and I look also at Mr. Smotrich, who was an amazing uh, Minister of Transportation. He will do a great job, and this is why I really, really hope that he will sign as fast as possible for us to start uh, working uh, together, because Israel really needs this new conservative right-wing government, professional government, that has, that has the response and got the trust of the Israeli people.